Boston University ice hockey is officially underway. The women's team geared up for a successful scrimmage against the Holy Cross Crusaders on Saturday, winning 2-0 and kicking off a much-anticipated season of college sports. Walter Brown Arena finally welcomed fans back to the rink after a year of strict COVID regulations. And with new students on campus, this was the first time some of them have ever watched college hockey. Oh, you know, I'm just here to support some fellow Terriers, watch some awesome hockey. For spectators, all the same COVID-19 protocols apply. BU advises you to wear your face mask at all times, except while eating or drinking. The women's team introduced six new players this year, including freshman Maggie Hansel and freshman Liv Haig, both of whom got some time on the ice. But with fans finally back in the arena, some returning players also got the spotlight. Because of COVID, we weren't able to get to the rink last year, so we saw it on, it was live streamed, um, and the COVID cut the season short. So this is exciting. I'll be at every game that I can go to. The game was stuck at 0-0 well into the third period, but a goal from Haig, her first goal as a Terrier, and a goal from junior forward Julia Neeris put the Terriers on top. But the win doesn't come as much of a surprise given the women's recent success in the 2019 Beanpot as well as their 6-0 record against Holy Cross. And according to head coach Brian DeRocher, much of that win has to do with the fans. It really is nice to have a little bit of energy, uh, you know, people in there because um, these kids, they'd love to play in front of, you know, 3,800 people in Brown Arena. But if it's uh, 380, they're more than excited. While this was only a scrimmage match, the women's first official game of the season kicks off Friday, October 1st, where they will face New Hampshire. But you can catch them here at Walter Brown Arena, October 2nd. With BUTV 10, I'm Cameron Morsberger.